the switch contacts or they can't cut off the power. Shut off the power. I can't. They're nose of the terminals. Glad that guard didn't call my bluff. Our bluff? I don't understand, Buck. You don't think I would have shot our friend Talon, do you? Our friend? After all the lies he told the council about us? He was only acting under orders from Lasker. Why, I can't imagine. Maybe we can find out if we can get him out of here safely. Is there no other way to cut off their escape? Only by closing the safety gate at the other end. But that would mean their death. Close the gate. You forget that Prince Talon's in that car. Close that gate. You have no right to give orders here. Get away from that switch! Buck, look! The tunnel's blocked! Pull the reverse lever, quickly! I can't! Wilma? I don't think so. I think it was really more fright than anything else that made me faint. I'm going to get Talon out into the air. Imprison this man till the council decide what sentence to impose for attempting the life of Prince Talon. Prepare those terminals. Call up the Zarks for wrecking car detail. seem to be. It's not unconscious. Still has that same vacant stare he had in the council room. Oh, it's you, Rogers. What happened? How did we get here in the tunnel? Uh, you had a sentence to death by your council, using you as a shield and making an escape in this bullet car when it was wrecked. I had you sentenced to death? Yes, don't you remember? Your permission will take charge of the prisoners. These Earth people are not prisoners. They are my best friends. I am sure your highness must be suffering from shock. You had them condemned to death, and I must return them as prisoners to the council. I can explain this. Laska took this from one of the amnesia helmets and put it in mine. And that's it? That's Kane's way of destroying the minds of his captives, forcing them to obey his commands. You can prove it by trying it on yourself. No. We are satisfied, and I'm sure the Council will be happy to know the Earthman has not broken faith with you. Clear the wreckage. Then we'll return to the farm and tell them the truth about Kane's Lieutenant Laska. Just a minute. Will you need all your men for this work? No. Why? I have three of Kane's men prisoners in their spaceship. I'd like to turn them over to your guards. By all means. Have four of your men accompany Colonel Rogers and obey him as they would obey me. What happened? 
Buck Rogers. Who's that rogue at Arlen? I'm sorry, Alaska, but we had to kill him. Here comes Buck Rogers with the squad of Saturnians. Fire the starting rockets. Gone wrong. They're taking off. We're following my spaceship. Rogers? Probably not. They've dumped the starting rockets and it'll take a half an hour to reload them. Uh, we'll never catch that cane ship now. Perhaps it's just as well. They're headed back for Earth anyway. We're at three quarter speed now, Alaska. Let me know when you want it to pull. You're not on the cross for Earth. And I'm not going to Earth. You're going back to Saturn? You don't want to go back to Earth and tell Killer Kane that Buck Rogers beat us again, do you? I'll start the retarding rockets. Not yet. We'll cruise around a while before we land. Have a look around for possible night patrols. All right. Come on, Roberts. You come with me, Scott. We have assembled to right a grievous wrong done to Buck Rogers of the planet Earth. Prince Talon has told us why he believes that we, the people of Saturn, should ally ourselves with the people of Hidden City rather than the outlaws of Killer Kane. How do you feel about the matter? Hand me the treaty. Prince Talon, you have earned the right to present this treaty to your friend. Ask him. of the planet Saturn to support you in your war against Killer Kane's outlaw armies. Thank you, Teller. And now, sir, with your permission, I'll call the scientist general on Earth. Tell him the news. You mean you can actually talk to the Earth from the planet Saturn? Yes, sir. That's why I had the radio brought here from the ship. calling the scientist general on Earth. Dr. Hewer's laboratory. This is the air control office. Colonel Rogers calling Dr. Hewer from Saturn. Dr. Hewer is in the air marshal's office. Thank you, I'll call him there. Marshal Craig speaking. Colonel Rogers from Saturn calling the scientist general. Rogers calling you, Doctor. 
This is Dr. Hugh R. Buck. I'm happy to inform you, sir, that Saturnian Treaty has been signed. Spend it, Buck, spend it. And Wilma, how is she? We're both fine, Doctor. We had some trouble with Killer Kane's men. I'll report that later. When are you returning? In a day or two, sir. There are a few minor details to attend to. Well, let me know when you start. I will, sir. Goodbye. We must find some splendid reward for that boy, Craig. It's not within the power of man to reward that boy for what he's done. What can be keeping Patton and Roberts? Can't make a move till they get back. Looks like them now. Run into any Saturnian patrols? No. Do you know that Robert we left for dead up in the rocks? What about him? Well, he's only stunned. He's as much alive as we are. Why didn't you bring him? We didn't dare try. A lot of those Zubs found him. They acted as though he was some sort of a god, the way they kept kneeling and bowing before him. So? This may be just the break we need. Let me have a look at that. Stay here, Roberts. Come with me, Pat. I think this will work out perfectly. I don't get the idea. If they think he's a god, they'll obey him. And I can tell them what orders to give them. That sounds risky to me. Of course it is. It's worth trying, isn't it? All right. Make these men prisoners. Gather all their men. We're going to free them from the rule of the Saturnians. Gather all Zugs. Follow these men to war on all Saturnians. just received word. The Zugs have risen in revolt. They are marching on the Forum. Marching on this Forum? Who is leading them? The Earthman, who tried to kill Prince Talon. That must be Laska, sir. If we don't stop him, he'll demand Saturn as vassal state to his leader, Killer Cain.
Summon General Calder. There is no time for that, sir. I suggest Buck Rogers be put in charge of our defense while we... It's a little too late for that, Prince Talon. Explain the meaning of this intrusion, Captain Lasker. Explain the purpose of our call. My friends, the Zugs have come to take over the rule of Saturn. From whom will you now take your orders? From our leader, Cain, of the Earth. And now, with your permission, I shall contact the leader, Cain, and have him send a spaceship squadron to keep order here. If he does that, we're sunk. I'll have to stop him. Careful, Buck. He won't hesitate to kill. Captain Lasker calling the leader Kane on Earth. Captain Lasker calling the leader Kane on Earth. Yes, Lasker, this is the leader. What have you to report? Look out, Buck. The dogs. <laughs> 